Most important of all is people are always talking about fundamental rights. Well, the Supreme Court has said that it is not your fundamental rights to have sex with animals. Why? You are, it's not your fundamental right to drive as you like on the road. You have to drive on the left side. The society has certain simple rules by which it can be organized. So same thing when we know that only man and women can produce the future of mankind. This uh, is, we consider this as a genetic flaw. And, but we don't want anybody to be discriminated on that basis or be thought of as someone who's not, not uh, you know, uh, who's not a human. We want, uh, I know many, many uh, homosexuals who have been editors, who have been lawyers, who have been judges, who have been commander in chief, I mean the military commanders. So they have never faulted on their performing their duty. So this is not a thing by which your, uh, your ability to serve society is reduced. But at the same time, to elevate it to a situation where this is an alternative way of living, that I cannot accept. And this is the American game and soon they will put uh, gay bars here where homosexuals can go. Then young boys will be taken there. Uh, HIV will spread. I mean, I, I, we, there are very many consequences of this. And uh, uh, last time a two-judge bench of the Supreme Court had opposed this. This has been overruled by five-judge bench. And I think after looking at the consequences that flow from this, uh, the next government should move a seven-judge bench to set aside this five-judge judge.